Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we will make a plastic stool in Autodesk Inventor by the means of freeform commands in Inventor software. So let's get started with today's video. Take the new part in standard. We don't have to take any sketch. Take a plane from freeform. Select the exit plane, give length of 250 and width of 250 and give faces to be 4 and length and width symmetric. Select the midpoint, the plane is been generated. Okay. Now select this face and Subdivide feature take 2 as width for both width and length and click on extract. Okay, now select the outer and right click and select the <clears throat> now. What you have to do is for this bottom profile select all the outer edges one by one you have to click one by one to select them ok almost done So now we have selected all the outer edges, right click and go to edit form, go filter as edges and transform as translation and X2. Select this arrow and drag it downwards and give a dimension of minus 20. Okay. Now you can see the bottom is hollow as it's been made in surface. No, <coughs> so now you have to take is uncrease edges and select the sharp edges this one and this one. It will automatically select uh, these edges, will be automatically get it selected and changed. Okay. <clears throat> now select these profiles this and this these are for legs and again select right click edit form filter edges translation and extrude drag it downwards and give a dimension of 280 this time uh, something is wrong select them again select four of them edit form minus 280 okay <clears throat> this is okay This, this, and this. Add it. Edges, transform, extrude. Okay, now, now it's perfect. Minus 280. Okay. Now, select this edges and insert edge command. Click OK. Similarly, do it for this. OK. We have done. Uh, there are two faces being created. This and this. Similarly, we'll do it for this side. Select this edge. OK. And once again, insert edge. And select the same edge. Okay. 
this is done for making this joint now take a bridge command and select this and click right click and click on continue and select this ok similarly we will do for this side take bridge command once again select this continue and this ok now it's a plain stool but we want this tapo profile like this for that select this half profile right click and edit form and you will see a point or a circle around this click on this point and drag it inside give it an angle of 5 degrees ok so it's bend it from one side but we want it for from another side as well so again we will select this half right click and edit form now it's been here and give it an angle of 5 degree ok now it's perfect symmetric from all sides but these edges are not in straight form they are in tapered form to make it uh, in plain form take xy plane take offset plane command drag it downwards and give a dimension of minus 300 ok now we will take the flatten command select these bottom you have to select only edges so select these edges and take flatten now and you will do it till plane and select this plane uh, something is wrong now it's selected take flatten take this plane and this so now they are till these planes <coughs> ok now <coughs> this is complete from surface part now you can exit the freeform command ok it's now having a zero thickness for providing it a thickness take the thicken command select the quilt and it will select whole body at once and give a thickness of 3 mm ok <coughs> now <coughs> take exit plane and sketch take a circle command and draw a circle of 30 dia and take extrude command reverse its direction and cut profile through all now we have to give <coughs> fillet here of 10 <coughs> similarly at this edge this edge you have to apply it for all the bottom edges this edge and similarly this you have to do it for all four sides this edge ok now it's done now select these edges apply a fillet of 2 mm to 
and this is also two. Now it's done. Okay. Now you can hide this form. It will be smooth now. Now give the appearance. Select the red color. I mostly give red color, light red color. But you are able to see these edges. For this, go to view, take shaded, and it's complete. Hope you like the video. Please do hit like button and subscribe the channel for more such videos. Thank you.